Hi, I am Devjani Nath. Welcome to my channel Craft Addict. Today, I am going to show you how to crochet this pink pink flower. This flower is used as a filler flower to add color to the flower bouquet. I hope you will enjoy it. You can follow me on Instagram and Facebook. So now let's get started. For this project we will need this white color yarn that is four ply knitting yarn and this is for making flower and this one is green color for making leaves and I'll be using two needle one two millimeter and another is 2.5 millimeter crochet hook. And also we will need a pair of scissor and stitch marker and this craft wares one is thinnest this one is thinnest and another one I we will use for making steam And I will be using this synthetic cotton as a filler. For making flower, I will be using this 2.5 millimeter crochet hook and 4 ply knitting yarn. First we will make magic ring. If you don't know how to make magic ring, please check out my previous videos. Make a magic ring here first. And then in this magic ring, we are going to make six single crochet. So start making six single crochet. Now I have made 6 single crochet here and now pull the yarn and we will start the next round. In the next round we will work in the back loop from this next round. Make 2 single crochet in each stitch. So at the end of this round we should have 12 single crochet. Remember to work in the back loop of the stitch now we will go to the next round and we will work in spiral so there will be no slip stitch work in the back loop in this round we will make one single crochet in the first stitch and mark your first stitch always and two single crochet in the next stitch this round we will follow this pattern one single crochet in the first stitch and two single crochet in the next stitch in this way we will make this pattern in this round and at the end of this round we should have 18 single crochet stitch
now i have finished this round and i have 18 stitches now move on to the next round always mark your first stitch and work in the back loops in this round we will make two single crochet in the each of the two stitches and then two single crochet in the next stitch one single crochet in each of the first two stitch and then two single crochet in the next stitch so in this round this is the pattern so continue this pattern and at the end of this round we should have 24 stitches Now I have come to the end of this round, move on to the next round. Now I am starting the next round and in this round there will be no increase of stitches, only make one single crochet in each stitch. Mark your first stitch always and work in the back loops and make only one single crochet in each stitch from this round there will be no increase of stitches In this way, make one single crochet in each stitch and make five rows of single crochet. After that, I am coming back. I have completed five rows of single crochet and you can see it. And now we will start decreasing stitches. From this round, we will decrease stitches. Make two single crochet in each of the next two stitches and then one decrease two single crochet in each of the two stitches and then one decrease in this way we will complete this round So in this way, complete this round. Now I am starting the next round and this round we will make one single crochet and one decrease. One single crochet and one decrease. In this way, we will complete this round.
now you can see we have a small hole now in this hole now we will insert the filling Now again start decreasing stitches, one single crochet, one decrease in this way and we will end with one slip stitch. Now make a slip stitch, cut off the yarn and hide your yarn. Now in this ball, round ball, we will work in this stitches. You can see these stitches. In these stitches, we will make fluffy details. Add your yarn again and make eight chains and then one slip stitch into the next stitch. Again, one slip stitch into the next stitch and then again make eight chains in this way we will work in each of the stitches eight chain one slip stitch to the next stitch and again one slip stitch and then again eight chain in this way go on working and complete the whole round Now this is the flower, pink pang flower, you can see it.
now I am going to make flower torus for that we will make I am using this 2 millimeter crochet hoop and we will make magic ring and in this magic ring I am going to make 7 double crochet Now join with the slip stitch to the first chain 3 and close the round. Turn inside out in this way. Now make chain 3, sorry chain 4 and from the second chain make one slip stitch in each of the three stitches and then slip stitch to the next stitches you can see it make slip stitch to the next stitch This is the sepal and again make chain 4 and from the second chain one slip stitch and then again one slip stitch to the next stitch and then again chain 4 in this way make 7 sepals. Now I am going to make the leaf, for leaf we are uh, using this green yarn and make 15 chains. Now I will be using this thin wear for making leaves and work one single crochet in each stitch with this wear.
now turn your work and turn also the wire and work on the opposite side in the similar way make a slip stitch and this is the end of the first round and we are starting the next round make one decrease in the first two stitches and then chain two make a picot stitch that is that is slip stitch to the first stitch and also slip stitch to the next stitch again again make one decrease chain 2 slip stitch to the first stitch and then again slip stitch to the next stitch In this way complete your round and slip stitch at the end. Now we will assemble this leaf, flower and torus. I am showing you. Watch it carefully.
so this is our pink pink flower i hope you enjoyed thank you very much for watching and if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and press the bell button so that you can get a notification early i shall leave all the information in the description box below do like share and comments i will try my best to answer you see you in my next video till then bye bye have a great day